Hello everyone. Oh my God, I'm so hot. Sweating like a bitch right now. Is this what Beyonce feels like? Except she, <laughs> she has someone to do it for her. <gasps> Hello everyone. Thank you so much for joining me today on this little, little quick little video that I'm putting out. Um, before I start, I just want to say, please, can you like the video, subscribe to my channel if you haven't already and uh, leave a comment down below what you think. Um, so, uh, I got this message from uh, a man who slid into my Facebook um, messages uh, about a week ago. Um, and this is, what he said. Okay, I'm going to read it to you. Absolute rubbish. What nonsense you are doing in the name of stand-up comedy. What, like as if, is comedy like a religion? Like, last I checked it wasn't. Um, most people who do comedy are pretty atheist, let's be honest. Okay. You don't have any other topic other than sex. It's really irritating. And you think it's comedy. Rubbish. Great. Okay. Uh, and of course, like, you know, didn't respond, which is always the way I am with uh, people who message because I'm like, cool, thank you for taking the time out of your day to tell me how shit you think I am at doing my job. And then obviously didn't reply. And then he just messaged back with a one word, which is muscat. And I wasn't sure <laughs> if this was... <laughs> A slur. I checked online. I Googled it as it is. And of course, Muscat is the capital of Amman. Anyway, I was a little bit drunk the other day. I messaged back, what do you want? Which I thought was fine. You know, just like I'm actively asking, what do you want? But what I wasn't expecting was a voice message reply from this lovely gentleman. I was a bit anxious about hearing it. I wasn't sure what um, it was going to be. So I thought, why don't we listen to it together? Um, and I'm going to see how this goes. So here we go. Hello. Good evening, Elena. Thank you. Thank you so much for your response. I'm really touched. Okay. <laughs> I'm really touched by my response. My response was, what do you want? But I'm glad to hear that my really angry, passive aggressive response made him feel touched. Let's move on. Lately, I started watching all your stand up comedy, uh, you know, episodes. Okay, um, great. Uh, I'm glad he is watching my stuff. I'm hoping on YouTube so that I can get some money because nothing nothing is sweeter than getting that sweet AdSense revenue from hate clicks. I really liked it because the way you present, you have got a lot of, uh, you know, the way you, your body language and the way you uh, describe, uh, you know, things, everything is fantastic. Can we just scroll back up to the message he originally sent to me, which was... So how have we just gone from like irritating to touched? I'm confused. And so is this guy. I really love it. I mean, there's no doubt about it. I, I, I was a little disturbed with the, the consistent, uh, you know, content, which is uh, based on your experience, your uh, dating experience at various, uh, you know, people and, uh, you know, it's somehow it's uh... okay so he starts a thought and then that's it it's like he can't even say the word sex he's trying to tell me what he thinks and he can't even do it and so okay that's one minute long that's a one minute message and then there's another one another message underneath for two seconds okay what is he gonna say in this two seconds let's um let's hear it that was it did you get that let me play that one more time so I'm just assuming at this point that he's just so happy that I re responded to him and um, that maybe he really does secretly want a really strong, powerful woman to tell him what to do in his life. I don't know. That's it. There's no like climax to this. I just thought it was like hilarious that someone is trying to write me something and then it <laughs> doesn't even happen. Guys, I know I shouldn't be reading this stuff. I know, but it's funny. It's funny that someone sends me a voice message. It's funny when people email me and say, Hey, um, you should like follow Jesus and follow God. Um, okay. Like I find this stuff really interesting because <laughs> what else have we got right now? Like, this is it. This is my entertainment guys. This is fun. So anyway, 
be kind, be kind on the internet. That is the end of my thing. And uh, don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Lots more new content coming soon. I promise you. And don't forget, I do have my tour on sale now. So do go check out my Europe tour and my Australia tour for this year, September, October, November. So go buy tickets and see me live in some dingy little seated theater with probably 50 people because that's all I can have right now. But it's going to be super intimate, super fun. You'll be able to feel the sweat on my face, like just in your presence. So it'll be fun. Um, but I'm super looking forward to it and I'll see you guys all soon. And thanks for watching. Bye.